You don't believe me, do you? You don't know what I should believe. I don't even know what happened. It's fine. Hey, Chungke, Suke, mentioned it earlier that there are some issues with the recording equipment, so we will have a day off tomorrow. Since we have nothing going on, wanna hang out tonight? I'll be going out for a while. A friend invited me for a drink. Okay, I'll be going to this bar called Lai Shi. Don't worry, it will be fine. San Ke, but we stayed here to stick out. Tiger Ligauter. If something happened to him, we won't be up any hair from here. I'm afraid that we will come into him inside. I don't want to let him know that I'm telling him when he trust out for rings. I can't even let him know that you are protecting him. Anyway, we quick one part too. Why can't we go in for a drink? It's so crowded inside. Do you know what kind of pie this is? San Ke, there's something up about this bar. Stop. Even if he is interested in Chung Ke and wants to pursue him constantly, getting close to him like this is a way. Lin Chu. San Ke, what kind of alcohol do you want? You can fucking drink you broke here. It's fine. We can just get something. Get someone to pick up, pick us up. Just drink. It's my treat. Any drink will do. Now get closed. Tell me, who sent you? What? Don't move. Pe- what I'm supposed to say? No, what's even happening? Yang Yu Tua, why are you here? Chung Ke, what's this about? It was just going to the toilet when San Ke pinned me here. Yang Yu Tua. I'll give you three seconds to let go of him. One, two, three. Chung Ke, you should go back. I will plan it to you some other time. But it's all right now. It's merely a misunderstanding between us. Come on, go home. San Ke, why are you here too? Did you arrive? Yeah, give me the keys. I'll ride it back to the shop for you tomorrow. You should call the taxi and go home. Oh, sure. Hello, Sao Ke. Lin Shui said Lao Shan had too much to ring and to check with you if everything is okay. Oh, good. We are in the car already. All right, then. Thanks for the call. Tell me a reason. Why you think something's wrong with Lin Chu? You didn't know he wanted to go to the restroom as well, did you? Right. After you left, he followed it after you. Zhang Yu Tua. I know you are trying to protect me, but I already can't take it anymore. Tonight, you have to answer all my questions. If you are unwilling, I'll move away next month. I already have enough on my place. Just like it as we were never friends. Don't do that. What do you want to know? Who are they? What did you see? You should have seen them before, although you may not have known. For instance, 
That day, when you were on the other side of the street, did you really not see anything toward your left? I really didn't see anything. Tell me, who are they? They have been following me for many years. I can see them almost every day. Where are they from? How many of them? They are sent by my parents. You mentioned before that you call them your parents. Are you guys related by lot? I don't know. Then where did your parents get people to follow you? Because I escaped it. You have left for a long time, but why do they still? I can run for them. They said that no matter where I go, they will be able to find me. And now that they have found me, they will keep on following me. These people who are you, f- who are following you, do you know them? No. For so for all these years. There have always been people following you, and these are people that you have never seen before. Is that what you are saying? Yes. At the start, do you think I was one of them? Yes. Then why did you change your mind? I can't even turn on the gas stove, and you can't do anything. Why do you think that they will harm me? We act together and are close. Isn't Chung Ching even closer to you? Why is he completely fine? You are not the same as them. How am I different? They won't want to ask me questions like this. How do you decide what kinds of people are? I can tell. I can feel it too. When they noted that I've seen them, they will run away. Then Lin Xu, I can tell. I've seen too much. Sometimes I'll get injured, but not severely injured. They are trying to tell me that I can escape. I can never escape. Why do you call the scout? It's useless. Why do you say it's useless when you have never made a police report? Have you ever tried? That's enough. I wanna. That's enough. Tell me, the dogs you mentioned. What do they do? Shut up! Stop asking already. Stop asking enough. They will know. They will hunt you down. The dogs are straining. They are fighting. They are starving. They want to sleep, but the dogs can try. They can speak. They are scared. I'm scared. I can let him stay in the car any longer. You are safe now. No one can hurt you. I'm scared. We have to get out. Do you know why I don't want to tell you? Because you don't believe what I say. Trung Ke, you don't believe me. You won't believe a single thing I say. Yeah. How do you expect to me? Expect me to? I believe that you want to protect me and you don't want to hurt me. But on the dangerous situation, I have encountered, encountered, encountered. Were because of you. If I had been any more ill, I would have stayed it away. Then why didn't you? Do you even have to ask? I already told you I'm interested in you. I bet that was you saying, but you just didn't say it out loud. I know you don't want me to follow you around. I didn't mean for you to find out. That I'm following you, Edel, but I really can have others getting hurt again, all because of me. I'm scared. Who got hurt? He said, "You are safe now." At first, I couldn't recall who it was that said 
that to me. But now, you remember? No, I merely remembered that he died. I wasn't safe, and it will never be safe. Will you be moving out? Would you? You are scared. I'm not. You are scared. I can tell. I know fear all too well. Too well. I think it's only natural for me to be scared. But right now, I'm just tired of it. If those people are the one who are following you, if they knew that we weren't close anymore. Or that we were no longer in contact. Would that keep you from having to worry about my safety? Are we still friends? Yeah. The old madam will be leaving tomorrow afternoon. I'll be able to ring Miao back. Yeah. Well, although. It's before the upgrade day. It's not a bit of the lease contract. If you want to move out, but you know, if you can't find a place on such short notice, you can continue staying here. I see. It's so early in the morning. There's no rush to return the car. You can ride it for another two days. Okay, I need to move now. Stop this afternoon anyway. Were you alright last night? Did you get into a fight with someone? I thrust over because of the commotion. I heard there were people quarreling. It didn't get physical. It's a most Chinese New Year. Wanna come over to my house again this year? My mum was asking about it yesterday. She wanted her to go shopping for the festivities. Festivities. Our bus. I'm going out in a couple of day. What? Where are you going? To recuperate. But you have never gone for that during Chinese New Year before. Why did you pick this time in this time row? I just go when I feel like this. I don't want big specific times. Then reschedule it. It's Chinese New Year. Who has the time to have you recuperate? Get a few guys to keep a lookout. Be close to rental apartment tomorrow. It's a more Chinese New Year. Forgot about those who aren't going home, but don't let those who are us rent get away. That's all. I'm going out. Okay. Trung Ke, I prove breakfast. Trung Ke, did he go out to look for a new apartment? Be good. We we are going home. I'm going to take a look at the shop. Call me if anything. Hello. Have you come to take the cart back? I'm still outside. Yeah, I've taken it. Okay, I'm just checking. All right. I'll be having dinner with a friend tonight. Things are going pretty well. I see. Did he call so that I wouldn't worry about him, or is he afraid that I'll? Hello, San Kua. Recently, Chakali Culture has been backing up with all the carport post. He posts over. Okay, continue to keep an eye on him. Don't get discovered. 
Is he trying to avoid being drained? Could he be bankrupt again? No, fucking away. He hasn't stayed there for the full month yet. He hasn't terminated his tenancy. Yeah, give him a call when you are free and ask when he's going to do that. San Kuang, forget it. I won't ask anymore. People like him aren't the same as us anyway. He's not the first. I thought he was different from the others. He didn't put on airs, nor did he look down on earth. But in the end, shut up. Wanna drop the cat up at my place again while you are out? It's okay, I'll drink it along. Sure, we will be going on a trip tomorrow. I'll be a long road trip somewhere pretty far away. So be good. Meow. Are you going to continue renting a blackman? If you're not, I'll go over and return your deposit. I still, I think I'll terminate tenancy next month. So, you will be renting the apartment for another month. Yeah, I haven't finished making yet. Alright, then I'll call you again next month. Chang. Forget it. What's there to ask about? In the first place, I'm leaving to prevent him from closing it trying to protect me. If Chang Yu Duo find out that I'm asking about him, he will think that I'm being retainers again. Hello? Trung What? Trung I'll come and feed you home in the next couple of days. What are you trying to do? I'm just trying to bring you home. Aren't you coming to send Chinese New Year back at home? You ask you who asked you to do that? Trung Ke, that doesn't matter. I'll come and feed you so you just come home. Cheng Yi, can we crop all the pretends when we are in private? I just want to go home and spend Chinese New Year with us. Stop staying stop the way like like that. No one wanted me to come home for the New Year. Mom and Dad don't want that. No matter you do. Why don't you switch speaker mode and let that hear? I am not going home. Even if it's Chinese New Year, I won't go home. Chang, you have a bad cat. Yeah, I picked it up. It's really cute. I haven't heard from you in a long time. I think it's been almost two years. I didn't expect you to come all the way here to meet me. Miss Luor, I just wanted to talk to you. About that? Do you still see them frequently? No, hardly. Much less than more. Jiang, are you willing to come over and try some trivial ex- experiments? Don't worry, you don't have to come. If you don't want to, we can just have a chat like this. You can set the time and place and I'll come and meet you. There's nothing wrong with me now. I don't need any test or evaluation. I'm here to have a normal chat with you about casual topics. Sure, we will have a normal chat. Don't use those features, conversational techniques on me, like choosing your words carefully and closely observing my reactions. I'm not your pattern, and I'm not a pattern. Sure, if you wish to have a chat like normal acquaintance do, so I go ahead and ask you things. Okay, did you come and meet me to tell me that you have recovered? Or are you trying to show me your current state so that I can tell you that you have recovered?
Stay still. I'm taking a photo. Why didn't you check your phone? I sent you a red packet. Take it. Oh, where are my New Year's greetings? Happy New Year, Lucy. Good. Hurry up and come back when you have done play around. Add your jeans and the other too. Let's all eat together. Okay. He is probably with shootings and the other now. They live in the same world as him and don't post a treat to him. He self after leaving me. Xiao Ge, you are really not coming over. There's lots of people here. It's lively. Yeah, thanks. I'll see you in a couple of days. Okay, Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, Jungkook. You have been locking up lately. How long has it been since you came for practice? You need to work harder after the New Year. Sure. Happy New Year, Jungkook. Chang Yu Tua. Ah, Happy New Year. It's really quiet on your side. Are you alone? Yeah. You are not hanging out with your friends or something. I mentioned it before that we define friends differently. I don't have friends whom I can hang out with during at a time like this. Did you go on a trip with Mel? Oh, I shot a photos. Yeah, it's quite funny. I didn't go on a trip for fun. I'm here to see my speech artist. I haven't been here in a long time. I'm quite resistant to these things. My wow will only get stopped at and freshly reopened. Well, it is trade party. That power to heart. I prove you wouldn't ever meet me again. What? I'm seeing the doctor almost every day. He said that is pretty effective right now. I practical, practically can't see them anymore. What I'm saying is that I recover after some time. If I recover, I you won't have to keep avoiding, avoiding me anymore. Jungkook, I have never had a friend like you. Such an outstanding friend, although you can even use a glass stone and talk in your sleep. Can you stop bringing that up? I don't know how to say this, but you treat me differently from how others do. I'm not talking about your interest. It's more like in front of you. I'm not Lao Shan or some truth. Ah, I don't know how to explain this. I'm hanging up. Shan Ge, it's Chung Ching. When are you coming back? It's a motor lantern festival. You already had dumpling along on the 5th. Are you spending the 15 along too? You are making it shout so tragic. Is it because you haven't been able to find someone to talk to? Yeah, that's probably one of the reasons I have missed you. When will your recuperation be done? Why don't you come back and I'll have you with that? I can give you a message. Use always step on your back and or whatever. Shut up. I'm hanging up. I'm gonna go. Miss Lua. The weather is red today. Baking in the sun feels very good. Look at the kitty. It's squinting its eye in the sun. Yeah, I thought you already went back and you haven't called it since that one time we met. I'll be going back in a couple of days before the lunch festival. I see. 
How are you feeling? Pretty good. A change of environment has helped me relax a lot. Chang, you insist that we interact like no more people do, right? Yeah, but why? Because I'm no longer a pattern. Can you tell me why you came to look for me? The last time we met, you refused to give me a proper answer. During the recent matter, Chang, there is actually no problem in me. Simply telling if you have already recovered. I believe that if the conversation and test wasn't between the two of us, you will probably get the answer that you want. You are very smart and sensitive. You know how to respond to make you not look like a pattern. What are you trying to say? You have always refused to admit that you sometimes act abnormally. It's been the same all these years. But now you came to me, wanting to use the fact that you recognize your abnormal actions to prove that you are normal. I'm sure there's a reason for that. There isn't a damn reason. Perhaps there isn't. Regardless. I think this is probably a good thing for you. I'm going. It's a more time to pay the rental fees. So, are you terminating your tenancy or not, Mr. Chung? You are back. Ah, oh, I heard you went home for the New Year. Why don't you have your luggage with you? I remember you bought two then you left. My luggage is still at home, which is right here. Oh, I thought you wasn't from around here, and that you had great language skills. You don't have an accent at all. Okay, see you. See you. Trung c a Are you terminating your tenancy? No, I haven't started looking for another apartment yet. I have been living in a hotel. Oh, then you can stay here. No one's chasing you out anyway. When did you come back? Just, I suddenly remembered that you are staying outside, so I came to help unlock your appliances and stuff before a fire or guard take occurs. I'm not that j e a l o u s am I? All the appliances were plugged in, and the balcony windows were left open. I guess I didn't notice. Have you eaten? No. Let's go. I'll treat you to a hot bath, but it's big hour right now, so we will probably have to wait quite a while. Why don't we make it ourselves? You know how, young master? Is that very difficult? Don't look at me. Watch your step. Didn't know your weight. Yeah, Zhang Jing said the same thing. The way myself, I lost about five kilo. Why did you lose so much weight? I don't know. How about you? What? Your face has limit down a lot. Is it because there no first delivery over the new year? Shut up and walk. Oh, I can't drink anymore. I still have to supervise work later in the afternoon. What if I fall asleep? Look like you are pretty weak. Even when I'm drunk and high, I can still fight people on the streets. Can you do that? I can. We, when we meet for the first time, that was the very first time I got physical with someone on the streets. I was waiting for c h u n g Jin to come over and have me fight the cat back then. It had been mowing in your hip, but you came and picked everything over. How was I supposed to know? I didn't hear the mowing. 
You were so incredible. You didn't hesitate in retaliating either. I told that you seemed it to be experienced. Hey, it's a most your birthday, isn't it? Yeah, I'll celebrate with you. Spending your 28th birthday alone, he said. Let's make it a lively evening. Forget it. I don't like noise and drought it. You prefer peace and quiet. Then I'll celebrate with you, just me. Do you really like celebrating birthdays? Yeah, because they are meaningful. It's the day a person came into the world. Let's live. It's like it. And nothing about questions to which there are no answer for. Even though it's just a meal, let's meet first and talk later. I read the dishes to you, young master. Sure, I'll take a brittle. I had too much to drink. Never mind, I'll do it. No, no, I do it. Hey, leave me alone. Just let me just die. You broke your witch. I heard it. Hmm? Ah. How is it? It's a scapegoat doctor. The doctor said I need to swear the planes for six weeks and give me some medicines. After that, I'll have to take the full video to show the process of my recovery and do rehabilitation, exercise, or something. It's nothing serious. Let it go. I did bit. You're tired. I didn't even complain when I was the one running around getting you a quick number, paying the pew and calling the man. Thank you. It's fine. You don't have to thank me. Shanku, you can take the car. I have things to settle my shop, so I'll get going. Okay. Sorry. Hmm? About earlier, I was probably a little sleepy. Yeah, well, I'm fine. It's fine, really. It's not mad at you. I think that was the third time already. I feel like I'm about getting used to it. Take out here. Are you still going back to the hostel tonight? Yeah, stay here for the night. I'll go over and have you back tomorrow. I'll go with you. Since you probably came back with the hand. Okay, all right. Take your time to eat. Where are your bed sheets? What for? To cover the bed. There's nothing on there. No need. I. You can't even do it with two hands. You think you are gonna do it with one? Zhang Yu Tuang. Hmm? You said that it's okay. I'm interested in you. As long as I hold it in and hide those feelings from you, right? Yeah, but when you are so considerate, yeah, considerate, when you are being so fucking sin- considerate, you can hold back those feelings. I don't want to make you uncomfortable, but you have got to consider my feelings too. I'll be the same even with Chung Ching. When Chung Ching fractured about his hand, I even helped him pet. He didn't even act like. Sangue, 
Are my Chongqing? If you have Chongqing shower, will he turn gay? Were you planning to have me bad? Yeah. Please don't. I don't want you to fall and fracture something else. I'm not Chongqing. You can't apply the same care and consult to me. Chongqing won't keep thinking of wanting to hurt you, snuggling up against you or wanting to kiss you. I'll just go back to the hostel. Today was a work enough. Let me call up a little. John, when I said that, it's not because I had something against you. The main reason is I've never met homosexuals before. I'm just not used to do it. Honestly, when you kissed me, I didn't find it disgusting. I didn't feel anything at all. I would rather you felt disgust. Don't take it too personally. I suppose you have been holding back for a long while, so I can shock up understand. What made you think that I've been holding back for a long time? I don't know. It's the first time I see him falling in fracturing himself just to kiss someone. You were panicking and in a rush. Who would believe that you haven't been holding yourself back? What a peculiar way of thinking. Well, how about I'm completely not panicking nor am I in a rust? I'll do it again in slow motion. What do you say? Do what again? What are you doing? I don't know. You should hit back. Yeah. I'll see you tomorrow and head to the hostel to pick up the stuff with you. Okay. Did the novel talk about losting business and horse keeping? But on, I only feel warm. It feels like someone gave me a warm pull when I was younger and I live with the rushes up against my face. It's just a warm feeling. Are you awake? Don't eat breakfast. I'll bring some over. Do you still feel like eating spiky rice dumpling? Sure. Can you make bigger one this time? It wasn't enough last time. Okay, have you brushed it just did? It's easy enough with an electric toothbrush. Did you plan on helping me with it, Shangga? No, I was wondering if I needed to bring you a bottle of my wash. It's fine, just bring me two spiky rice dumpling. Oh, I forgot to tell you that I need to drop my the store. The renovation will start today and they're also delivering the plans. That's fine. I have the day off anyway. Do you actually have rest days? Of course. On such major holidays, you don't do rain collection or fight. It's always been this way. Can you finish work by nightfall? Because Trung Ching invited you over to his house for dinner to celebrate the Lantern Festival. Yeah, I didn't want to invite you at first because I was afraid you wouldn't be too used to it. Trung Ching's parents are the same as us. We are all white fool. But I thought that not inviting you would be worse seeing no one cared about you celebrating the New Year's alone. You really have way to work now, hmm? 
So will you go? I go. I'm so miserable. After all, I was alone for New Year's Eve, still the Van Festival. Now there's finally someone who sympathized with me. Thanks for your handwork. No problem. We were almost done in the north morning. If it wasn't because your demand were high, we would have been done much earlier. Quality comfort. After all, no need to rust. What do you think? It's good. I look exceptionally high quality. I had to make a table and chair set in the net a few days, but my hand is injured. So come over and help me when I start, okay? Why do you know how to do woodwork? I won't be using wood, but salmon. What? Can you even know machinery? No, never mind. You will see it when the time comes. The planes have arrived. Hello, Zheng Ge. Lin Qu. Where are you? I have a friend who knows a nursery, remember? Zhu Ge show photos of it on my phone last time and since the planes look like vibrant than other that he seen. He asked me to be someone and send them over. Oh, I see. Hello, San Gua. About the Riversley. I'm sorry about that. Oh, I was just a tiny misunderstanding. No need to worry about it. What happened to your hand, John Gua? I accidentally feel. But I'm fine. I'll be as good as new in a month on show. I feel while riding a horse one time, and it was unbearable. It was so inconvenient. I think it's still okay. It's better than freaking a lot. You can go ahead and upload the other post. I'll put this in for now. Sure. Is the well broken? It's for pots of pot choice, not empty pots. What did you eat growing up? I trained you. Got a problem with that? We are elf, and you guys are fairies, right? Do elf thing do? Elf eat insect dong day. I understand why you never had a girlfriend, San Gua. Zheng Jin has clearly infected your friend with something. Come on, don't say that. Zheng Jin had a lot of girlfriends before. You know, he also had one. He almost married. I see. Well, I never wanted one anyway. Why not? No special reason. I just never told about it. When I see girls with any hint of interest in me. I avoid them. Then, why didn't you avoid me? My interest in you isn't considered minor, isn't it? You are not a girl. Besides, you are different from them. Okay, I thought maybe you should consider it a little more. What? It's nothing. You are probably like a fruit that film very late. Even when all the other fruits have been shot, you will still be in the tree waiting to ripen. I'm not a late rumor. I just didn't meet the girl, right girl. Let me send her. Let's do it together. Send her. I'm a blunt person. And I think you are the kind of person whose feelings also show on their face. So... If you think I've done something wrong, just tell me honestly. No, there's nothing. It's just the way I am. You don't have to mind me. I have nothing against you. Okay, that's good. It's cool. Can you wait inside? No one will steal this plan.
Okay, I'll leave it to you guys. Then, have you known Trunku for a long time? Not really. The two of you seem close. I wouldn't dare speak to him that way. Shuke mentioned it that you, the two of you were friends. I prove that you were both friends. Isn't that right? Hmm? Oh my, I seem to have said too much. Wait, well, what I said doesn't count. Okay, then you will keep a safe distance from Chunke like this, right? I'll be going Sanke. I leave you guys to do it. Where's Chunke? I told show him come inside just now. Let him know. I have left then. Tell me if you need any furnishing later and I'll look for them. Sure. Chunke. No way. Did he... Hustlish. What are you trying to give someone to freaking hurt a check? Oh no, I told Tunku met them again and I just I can let him think that I'm not well enough. I need to think up a good excuse. Did you look cool? Cool my friend.